I'm Mark Dawkins, Dean of the Cochran College of Business. So I started as Dean of the Cochran College of Business in June of 2015. The idea for the Center for Entrepreneurship came about after my first year on the job where I realized the University of North Florida had a critical role to play with respect to entrepreneurship and the entrepreneurship ecosystem in Jacksonville. So in August of 2016, I got together with Teresa Nichols, Coggins Director of Development, and we formed a task force which consisted of about 20 community members who were entrepreneurs. The benefactor of the Coggin College of Business, Luther and Blanche Coggin, are very passionate about entrepreneurship and passionate about the University of North Florida. And ultimately, Luther and Blanche Coggin pledged a lead gift of a million dollars to start the Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation in downtown Jacksonville. In January of 2019, we opened the center. We have hired an outstanding director for the center in Karen Bowling, who has an outstanding career as an entrepreneur herself in successful career. And she's going to bring that talent and experience to help other entrepreneurs in our local community. My name is Karen Bowling, and I am the director for the Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation. I grew up in Jacksonville, so I've seen a lot of the changes and have seen a lot of people who have felt like they had to leave Jacksonville to get a job and I'm really pleased that like over 80% of the students that come out of UNF actually stay in Jacksonville. A lot of young people today want to just have more control over their career or their lives and so they want to start their own business and work for themselves. The goal is to have students in the center by August 20th which is the start of the fall term. What we're doing between now and then is we're developing the selection process. So we're going to host 15 to 20 of the best ideas and and these will come from both students as well as the community and they will get space in the center for up to a year. I'm Elaine Johnson. I'm a principal in the Corporate Development and Strategic Investments area for Florida Blue and its parent company, Guidewell, and also immediate past chair of the Business Advisory Council at the University of North Florida's Coggin College of Business. I am the daughter of an entrepreneur. My father for many years had his own business here in downtown Jacksonville. And to see this Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation sprouting up on Adams Street, which is where he had his business, is such a full circle for me and so exciting. Entrepreneurship in small business is very important to our community. As a matter of fact, over 90% of all employers are small businesses, and that's where we see the greatest place for economic development and workforce growth. Having a center for entrepreneurship and innovation helps us to provide a venue where our students can learn both the technical skills about being an entrepreneur, where we can support budding entrepreneurial businesses, but they can also that develop that entrepreneurial mindset where they can apply that either in their own businesses or in larger organizations which still have a very important need to be nimble in this very dynamic time in industry. If you learn about the process of entrepreneurship, you learn how hard it is and what are the checkpoints that one goes through to be an entrepreneur, a successful entrepreneur, then when you have your own idea, you're going to be that much further ahead of the game in terms of how do you start that process. Great ideas come from everywhere, not just business students, and so we want to make sure all students can engage with the Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation. We have a fabulous co-working space, offices if they have to have, you know, private meetings. We've got classroom space for speakers bureaus and, and bringing in entrepreneurs to meet with the aspiring entrepreneurs. So we have a great space here, but it's about more than just the space. You know, it is about the help that they'll get. They'll be here working with like-minded people that they can bounce ideas off of, meeting with mentors and advisors. And then at the end of that year, they'll either move on to work with an accelerator program or they'll have an investment and be ready to start their business. The collaboration that can be facilitated by our Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation is going to be a real differentiator. While we've had space and other kinds of support for emerging innovators and early stage entrepreneurs, I think the fact that we're creating this entrepreneur, business community, student learning partnership, it's going to be a critical difference and something that's going to ensure a higher level of success. Having somebody who understands like the business and how it works and understands how to vet ideas and to problem solve, that employee is going to add a lot of value 
And I think that those kind of skills are just critical life skills. The opportunity to work in a space like this where they can work with other like creative, business-minded people uh, will help them you know, not only to develop their own ideas, but to brainstorm new ideas. Ultimately, we'd like to have a venture fund so that we can invest in businesses that start in the center. And, and again, I'm just excited about the opportunity to have the University of North Florida play a central role in entrepreneurship here in Jacksonville. I know Karen is partnered with Mayo Clinic on their Mayo Ventures initiative, and we're also partnering with other. We've partnered with the Jim Moran Institute. We've partnered with the Small Business Development Center. So we're reaching out to community, and that was another goal, was for the center to be a, a hub of entrepreneurship here in Jacksonville, and we're already starting to see that take place in terms of who, who Karen is working with and how many community partners are coming together around the Center for Entrepreneurship and Innovation to to help start and grow businesses for Jacksonville. So I'm super excited to see what the future holds for UNF, for the center, and for the Coggin College of Business.